Alrighty, the question you all want to know, the question that made you click on this video, can JVP myself dunk? No. Thanks for watching guys, I'll see you guys next time. Psych! So that's not the end of the video, but I wasn't lying earlier, I cannot dunk unfortunately, but there's a whole lot more to the whole story than just no. Um, we need to go back to about January of 2020. This is my freshman year of college. My God! Wow! And my buddies and I would play a bunch of basketball. We'd probably go to the gym about three, four times a week. We'd play games, we'd get shots up. We were in an intramural league. Um, so it was just super fun playing a bunch with, with, uh, with the boys. And after every time we'd play, we had this running joke that today was the day. We'd say, today's the day. And then we'd all go up for a dunk. I have one buddy who got pretty close. All of my attempts were just buns, pure and utter buns. And so here's a couple of those buns attempts for you guys. And as you can see, I was not close whatsoever. It was, it was terrible, it was trash. So fast forward to summer 2020, and I was trying to cut down a little bit, slim down so I could get up, I could jump. As you know, fat don't fly. And so um, I was running every day, I was doing a bunch of, bunch of cardio, and I was hooping every day. I also kind of had like a beginning little video test of how high I could jump on my own basketball hoop. Here's that video now. Just a disclaimer, my hoop is about three to five inches short, so that gives you some frame of reference. And throughout the whole summer, I just kept grinding, kept grinding, kept running, kept playing hoops, and here's what I ended up with. I was really satisfied with my results. I was super happy going from this to this. And being able to see results, I think was the biggest thing for me. And that's my advice to anyone trying to achieve a goal. I would just say, record yourself somehow. It felt really good just being able to, to get up a little bit. I was catching lobs, um, not really putting them down, but I was kind of getting those like rim grazer dunks on shorter hoops. Um, and so that felt really good. And so when school started up, I hit up my brother Tyler, who you guys have seen in videos. And we decided to do a little vert program. I think it was like, it's 16 weeks and you're supposed to gain like six to eight inches on your vert. And that's pretty much all both of us needed and we decided to document the whole thing on an Instagram page. It was really fun just having something to do with Tyler. Um, during COVID, there's not a whole lot of like ways to up your game in basketball because you can't play on the courts that the school provided. And so being able to just improve my game in this, this way was really fun, it was really motivating. And I could, I could honestly, I couldn't see a whole lot of results on in terms of how high I could get, but I was seeing results in, in terms of how high I could get on a consistent basis. It was like I was getting to my max vert more consistently more often, so that felt really good. Unfortunately, COVID hit us and I got put into quarantine twice, pretty much back to back. It was quarantine for two weeks, a six day period and then I was in quarantine for two weeks again and then I had break which I'm on right now and so that really really took a hit to the vert program I think we made it like six weeks in and then just got completely stopped by the quarantining so that brings us to today can I dunk well here is a video from today or whenever you guys might be watching this might be a few days ago um, of my best attempt.
it's been always a dream of mine to dunk a basketball and I'm honestly not going to stop until it happens. So I'll keep you guys filled in on that. If you guys stayed till the end of the video, shout out to you, you're a real one. Um, like and subscribe if you like content like this. I've got so many cool videos planned. I'm so excited for you guys. And I'll see you guys next time, as always.